Hello and welcome. My name is Chuck. I'm Old Man Tarot. I do daily tarot readings. Every day we ask the cards, what are our opportunities for the day? This is a reading for Monday, July 4th, 4th of July. Uh, what are our opportunities for the 4th of July? Everyone have a safe and happy holiday. I do daily readings. If you like these readings, please do like, subscribe, and follow. That way you won't miss any of our exciting daily readings. Let's see what the cards have to say for the 4th of July. First card is the Queen of Pentacles. Uh, we're probably, uh, Queen of Pentacles likes to enjoy nature. Uh, we're going to be outside on the 4th of July watching some fireworks or going to a, a banquet or a, a picnic. Uh, she's very, uh, people follow her because they love her. She exhibits a lot of love, a lot of safety, a lot of comfort. She's the first one to offer you some food, um, you know, plenty of food around. So, uh, you feel very much, uh, in control. You feel very much, uh, in control of nature and you're offering a lot of, uh, uh, nature and food and things to other people Next card is the knight of rods knights like to take uh, take action look at him. He's rushing in rods are your actions and your uh, Your thoughts your bravery uh, He wants you to be brave and take action um, and follow your passions. So he may be defending the queen here uh, uh, You know the knight often defends the queen, but you do have a lot of uh, royal energy in the today You're gonna be taking action about some passionate uh, things. Nine of Cups is the wish card. You're going to have a great uh, mid midway through the day on the 4th. All your wishes are going to come true. Again, it looks like you're having some type of a celebration or a picnic or a party. Everyone's kind of celebrating you or you're celebrating, you know, with your family and friends. Uh, the Nine of Cups, if you make any wishes today, they should come true. Um, so wish away on the 4th of July. Next card is the Seven of Pentacles. We're able to harvest a lot of what we're, uh, we've been planting with a lot of hard work, and we're doing well. We're succeeding. Our uh, work is coming in good. Our harvest is strong. The sevens also remind us to look into the future, make sure that we're planting seeds. It looks like we've done that. We have plants growing in the background, and think of ways that we can improve this harvest. Do we want to change the harvest, or is there something we can do that will increase the harvest? Finally, last day is the Wheel of Fortune. You have a lot of good luck on the 4th of July. The hand of fate reaches in and uh, helps you along your journey. Uh, take this opportunity with this Wheel of Fortune luck and uh, take action. The Wheel of Fortune, sometimes the hand of fate slaps you down. But today, it's going to help you along, push you up onto the wheel, help you rise up towards the sun, and help you accomplish your goals. So early in the day... Uh, you feel very comfortable with the nature. Uh, you feel like you're taking action. You're offering people a lot of food and energy. Um, and your people are following you because they love you. And you're offering a lot of comfort. Midway through the day, I think you have a party or go to a party with family and friends. Uh, this is a, a great time. There's a lot of love, a lot of emotional, a lot of emotional connections. And any type of wishes you make at this party have a really good chance of coming true. And later in the day... Uh, you're thinking about your future. Uh, you're able to harvest uh, from your past hard work. You got the rest of the year coming up. You're thinking about ways to improve what you're doing. And all day long, you have the, the hand of fate is uh, is helping you along. You have good luck on your side. Take action all day long uh, on anything that requires luck, and you will do well. My name's Chuck. I'm Old Man Tarot. Hope you have a great 4th of July. See you tomorrow.